So we're at the Flintville Fish Hatchery. We're in southern Tennessee, Lincoln County, towards the Alabama line. It's the oldest trout hatchery in the state, operation since the 1930s, and we raise about 120,000 rainbow trout. We only do rainbows per year. For this winter, we have a special bonus fish. These are gonna be albino rainbows this year. They look like giant golden trout. Some people call them golden trout. 19 inches. So these albinos we got from Dale Hollow National Fish Hatchery. They, they hatch about 1,000 every couple years. This year they had a surplus. They had a, a very successful hatch, so they had extra that they gave to state hatcheries. So we went up and we got about 150 or so just to raise, and we got them as fingerlings, so we didn't hatch them. We've had them for almost a year. They're rainbow trout, but they're golden in color. They're very colorful. Um, they're roughly 19 inches, and each one should weigh approximately one and three quarter to possibly two and a half pounds. Oh, that's a big one. Today, we're actually, we're gonna take 10 of the albinos and put them in the Elk River tailwaters below 10's Ford Dam. Seven pounds. We'll put approximately six in at the Highway 50 bridge access, and then approximately two, two, two miles downstream at it. They call it the cabin or the cabin site. We'll, we'll put four in there, so a total of 10 of these uh, golden trout we put in the tailwater today. Below Tim's Ford, uh, there's a lot of catch and release. Gonna try to catch one of these now? I am, I'm gonna put a woolly booger on or something. I got a lot of flies. Beautiful, beautiful fish, and uh, it'll be a thrill for anybody who catches one. So, something to uh, shoot for, other than the, you know, the small fish for change. So, yeah, it's wonderful. Wonderful. We have 100, about 120 of the golden trout, albinos, and they're going to be stocked in municipal ponds and lakes for the winter program. So those are run from the end of this month. We start November 28th in Nashville, and we'll run until February. We'll have one to two golden trout at each site, each stocking. Uh, the winter program, a lot of the streams, the majority of the streams, and rivers that these fish are put in are warm water streams, so in the summertime, the temperature would preclude these things from surviving. So we encourage them to take the fish, take them home, and either eat them or if they want to mount them, whatever the case may be, it's up to the angler. We had one that's, it's not an albino, but it's in the bonus tank. He, he's a standard Kamloops, the strain rainbow trout. He'll be stocked this winter too, he was eight pounds. Oh yeah! <laughs> Bring your heavy line. Have your, your poles be bending in the winter. So size, and they should put up a good fight for the anglers, and it's something that uh, is not a common, common fish to catch, though that, that angle too, that the angler can pursue something that's not a common rainbow trout.